saving victim, opening wide the gates of heaven to man below. A force press hard on every side, thy aid supply, thy strength bestow. O praise and thanks to thee ascend for One in three, O oh, grant us life that shall not end in our true native land with thee. begin some words of Oscar Romero. To each one of us Christ is saying, if you want your life and mission to be fruitful like mine, do as I. Be converted into a seed that lets itself be buried. Let yourself be killed, do not be afraid. Those who shun suffering will remain alone. No one is more alone than the selfish. But if you give your life out of love for others, as I give mine for all, you will reap a great harvest. Some words of Gerald Van. Without the sense of God's will, we narrow down our lives to the material world. We are like misers crouching over their hordes and never seeing the skies. Indeed, we may narrow our prison still further, seeing in everything only the image of ourselves. But once we are made aware of the greatness of events as expressions of God's love, once we see and live their sacramental value, then we are liberated into a greater life. The winds of eternity blow about us and the infinite skies are our home, and we too walk the eternal hills. I have no wit, no words, no tears. My heart within me like a stone is numbed too much for hopes or fears. Look right, look left, I dwell alone. I lift mine eyes but dimmed with grief no everlasting hills I see. My life is in the falling leaf 
O oh Jesus, quicken me. My life is like a faded leaf, my harvest dwindles to a husk. Truly my life is void and brief and tedious in the barren dusk. My life is like a frozen thing, no bud nor greenness can I see, yet rise it shall, the sap of spring. O oh Jesus, rise in me. We pray on this day that we may respond with generous hearts to the Lord's invitation to share in his passion so that we might share in his risen life. We pray that God will bless our keeping of this time We pray for all those in the church preparing for baptism and confirmation at Easter. We give thanks for all who are joined with us in prayer and sacrament in this present moment. We pray, Lord Jesus, for our world, broken and rent asunder by violence and warfare, by oppression. We pray for the needs of all refugees. We pray for those who do not have any bread to eat. We pray for all men and women of faith and of goodwill, seeking to create your kingdom on earth as it is in heaven. And we hold before you people who've asked for our prayers. Anne, Mike, Julie, Pauline, Roy, David, Jane, Julia, Cara, Maria Teresa, Derek, Beryl, Sharon, Dorothy, Evie May. And we pray for all those whom we love but see no longer who rejoice with us, that in your nearer presence, as our Saviour taught us, so we pray, our Father in who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil. Amen. Therefore we before him bending this great sacrament reveal. Types and shadows have their ending. 
for the new aright is here. Faith our outward sense befriending makes the inward vision clear. Glory let us give and blessing to the Father and the Son. On all might and praise addressing while eternal ages run ever to his love confessing who from both with both is one. Amen. Lord Jesus Christ, we thank you that in this wonderful sacrament you have given us the memorial of your passion. Grant us so to reverence the sacred mysteries of your body and blood that we may know within ourselves and show forth in our lives the fruits of your redemption. For you are alive and reign with the Father in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God, now and forever. Let us adore forever the most holy sacrament. O oh, praise the Lord, all you nations. Praise him, all you peoples. For great is his steadfast love towards us, and the faithfulness of the Lord endures forever. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and shall be forever. Amen. Let us adore forever the most holy sacrament. 